My studio has created a free downloadable DIY face mask kit for our friends, family and community. On our website there will be a link on our menu called face mask where you can download an image and print this on an A4 page which will allow the pattern to be cut out to size. Our face masks have been designed with a slit to allow you to place an antivirus filter inside. We're now going to take you through a video tutorial showing you in a very simple step-by-step -step, um, guide of how you can make this in the safety of your own home. You will need to print the download template, fabric, elastic, pins, scissors, a sewing machine, thread, and an antiviral mask filter. Start by cutting two pairs of the main mask pattern piece and one pair of the filter mask pattern piece. Pin the pieces to your fabric and cut it out really neatly. Next, sew the center fronts of all three pairs. If you are using pattern fabrics, put your pattern sides facing towards each other when sewing. If you pin the centre front seam first, then it'll make it easier and neater for you to sew this curved seam. Snip into your curves without cutting into your stitch line. This will help your curve to bend better. Then. Press open your centre front seams on all three pieces and iron them into place. Fold and press one centimetre on the side edges of all your pieces. On your filter piece, this is the smallest one, top stitch the fold. Now it's time to layer your pieces together. Place one of the main mask pieces facing up, then layer your smaller filter piece on top also facing up. Line up your center front seams on top of each other. Place the main piece facing down. Pin this and sew across the top and bottom. Remove your pins and turn your mask inside out. This will hide all your raw edges. To attach the elastic to your mask, hold your mask up to your face and check how long you need your loops to be. Make sure you leave at least one centimeter on each end that can be sewn inside the mask, then stitch into place. You are almost there. Give your mask a quick press to finish here is the valve where you can place your antivirus filter inside. And you are done! It is the perfect time for you to recycle and reuse materials that you have in your own home. With the recycling of household goods, you can be really creative and really dynamic in your sourcing choices. Some ideas could be using cotton blend t-shirts, any old clothes, as well as dishwashing towels and vacuum cleaning bags. The tighter the woven fabric, the better, and you can hold this up against the light to see how much light it lets through. Sending a lot of love to you and your families from me and my studio. Stay safe, and I know that we can transform this situation with a united community spirit.